I'm not sure if you're filming anything. All right, so it's outside. Looks like a little bit of a storm head up there. Nothing here so far. I bolted out of bed because I was worried I needed my sun time. Anyway, so this is <laughs> whatever this is now. Um, heavy glitter. I don't know how much is going to fall off it because it's only glue. And it's only, it's, you know, has a baked, like the process is complex. The chemistry involved, all right, so this is the bake. Heavy on the glass, like I said, this is what probably would be the simplest one. Um, the glitter would probably fall off at a much, there is no, there's no sprays of any kind except the glue, the glitter in the glass on this one here so far. And like I said, I know nothing until the acrylic goes on. And we have to wait. So this will, for the next two days, will be in this position of drying. Because I want, I need to, because I have to see how much is going to fall off. All right? And I hope to God no rain comes. But anyway, so this is the step, I don't know, five. <laughs> Let's switch to, to photo mode.
So GB, I am so sorry you're not here to see the um, process. I mean, this is your mother's. Um, I realized that I would actually have to make an acetate of the names to, because the names have disappeared. Now they may come back based on the resin. But like I was saying to you, that these mats would have to come from a period from the 16th, 17th, 18th century and, uh, and be befitting of someone whose familiar lineage was, you know, an aristocrat. So they would have had very exorbitant, um, incredible pieces of uh, um, tableware. Um, the acrylic that will go over the, this will seal it. Um, I don't know as high, because this might be pretty high, uh, but it will definitely give uh, a very smooth surface. It will have to. Okay, so we're looking probably be like half an inch. Okay, so when I was trying to describe it to you, I couldn't, I mean, I knew it was in my mind, but I also knew you couldn't possibly imagine this. Okay, so this is the first piece to be done. I'm taking a bit of a break. It takes a couple of hours, and that hot, hot gun man burning my hand. And like I was telling you, the raffia and the uh, cook the branches, that's all in here. And that's what gives it the authenticity and the feathers and the, and the you know, I'm not kidding. Broken glass, and I have tons of it. So, that's the foundation um, to, to give it, you know, like I said, it's going to be quite ceramic when it's finished. But I think you can see from this that it is stunningly gorgeous. So let me flip to picture mode. Talk soon, though.